Got an emergency uh, supply, 15 days of uh, modafinil from the pharmacy at Walmart. And um, yeah, she, I said, well, the last two times I call, I'm very clear on the phone, and the doctors on the phone get it wrong. And I notice when I pick up at the pharmacy, and she sees on there it says uh, 150 early in the morning and another 150 before noon. I said, well, I've never said that, it's 100. So it's a 250. I said the error before that was even worse. I said it was the right amounts, except the second dose of 100 was before bedtime, which would screw everything up. So, you know, she can't fix it. She's got to repeat the error, right? Because it's, it's systemic issues that can't be fixed. You need a doctor to be upset with me to fix something, really. And give me attitude so they can fix their own errors. And then, you know, and then it's that episode of Seinfeld where Elaine gets blacklisted by all the doctors. That's pretty much it. So look here. <clears throat> so, although it says on my resume who I am and what I do and what I care about and what my priorities are, uh, every employer that hires me is uh, there. They're surprised eventually when I act this way and we're in conflict. And it doesn't take years. It takes weeks. So again, it tells me what I've been saying a long time is I have to be self-employed, but I can be self-employed because it costs too much money to rent a place that people would see in the corner of this lower part of the mall, where it would say um, services by donation. It would be education related, and it would be mental health counseling related, okay? Now if anybody comes in and they say, you don't have this, 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 again, I would challenge them right away to a test to see who has these skill sets better, me and them, and we'd find a volunteer, right? And, and if I'm here long enough, there'd be somebody volunteering. And hopefully somebody new, let's say, that none of us had seen, and we'd counsel them, they'd agree to be videotaped, and we'd see the skill set difference. And then you would think results matter. They say, well, you still gotta go get... No, I don't. I'm, I've got enough diplomas already. I create more positive results with learners, patrons, patients than you do. The fact that you keep wanting to shut me down proves me right about your HSD. There's something wrong with you. You can't self-correct. It's funny, there was a First Nations guy walking with a shirt. I'm reading it quickly. I'm here. You're welcome. So, so he, he sees me. I had already finished reading his shirt. He said, hey, you know what? Thanks for being here. He said, hey, you're welcome. He said, have a good day. And we both laughed. It's funny. It's a cool shirt, right? And, uh, you know, it, it kind of promotes, you know, a, a value of each other. It's good.